Uh, it's not been an ideal build up to this race um, for all the reasons that everyone else could tell you about why their build up wasn't great. But you don't always, if you, you can never have a perfect build up leading into a race, or if you do, it's once in a lifetime, or at least super rare. Um, but that doesn't always mean you're gonna have a disappointing performance, and in fact, a lot of times you have great performances when you're not expecting to. And maybe that's because you don't have as much pressure on you. Um, or maybe it's just because you weren't a great judge of your fitness going into it and you actually had more than you thought. Okay, 2022. Once we start the gun, it is go time. In terms of goals over the next two, three, four, five uh, years, man, it just keeps changing. I've already accomplished a lot of my biggest goals in the sport. Um, getting sponsored in the first place, having someone support my hobby, that was never actually a goal of mine, but once it happened, it checked a big you know, box that I didn't even know was open. Um, so that, honestly, the day that happened, the day someone, a company decided to give me shoes and plane tickets to fly around to races. I could quit running after that and I wouldn't want to quit running after that, but I could have done it that day and said, I was a great runner. <laughs> I did it. Um, but in terms of goals that I have had and achieved, Western States top 10 was, um, I thought that was going to be the end all be all in my career is spending everything I had trying to be top 10 at States. And I got it on my first try. Um, and that left a lot of time to develop new goals. Good, but that's all right. I like walking. <laughs> You're gonna get it done. Oh yeah. Say the goals are always evolving, um, but I'm always kind of trying to balance the sense of ambition with the appreciation for um, the lifestyle and the fact that I just am so privileged to be able to do it at all. So if you go in and, and your definition of success depends on a certain level of performance, then I think, you know, maybe at a certain level that's, that's important. Um, but uh, I, think it, I think that level of ambition needs to be balanced with an appreciation of, of what you got. And um, maybe I skew a little too far towards appreciating it and just being stoked to be here. <laughs> yeah, so I mean, I, I'll probably put pen to paper and come up with some goals for performances soon. I think Hoka would probably like that.
Exactly. You get through it. 